In this video, we're going to learn how to square a binomial with radicals inside. You may recall that if you have a binomial and it's squared, you can take the first term and square it, and you can take the product of the two terms inside parentheses and multiply them by two for the middle term, and you take the last term and you square that. You should always be sure your final answer is simplified. So now that we recall this rule for a binomial squared, we're going to use it when we are solving or simplifying example one and example two. In example one, we have the square root of six minus the square root of two quantity squared. So we have two terms inside. It's a binomial raised to a second power, so it's a binomial squared. We're going to square the first term, and we're going to take the product of the two terms inside parentheses. When we multiply two and six, we get 12. And we're also going to square the last term. All right, so it's important to remember that if you have a square root of six squared, it's the same as square root of six times square root of six, which is the same as the square root of 36, which is also the same as the square root of six squared, which is just plain old six. I'm showing you this so that you can see the process, but it's important at this point to be able to recognize that at this point right here and realize that it's just a plain old six. So I'm going to go ahead and erase this. And another way of thinking about this would be if you have a square root of a six and you're squaring it, you're kind of undoing that square root, so it's just six. Minus two root twelve plus two. We can simplify this further because if you notice six and two are like terms and so we'll have eight minus two root twelve. Twelve, if you factor it, will give you something that can be pulled out, so it'll be eight minus two root two squared times three, so we can pull a two out as well, so we'll have eight minus four root three. So that's my final answer there. It's been simplified as far as it can be simplified. Let's move on to example two. Again, we have two terms raised to a second power, so it's a binomial squared. So we're going to square the first term. Take the product of the two terms and multiply them by two. And then square the second term in the binomial, which will be plus nine times seven. Okay, simplifying that further, we get four plus twelve root seven. Nine times seven is sixty-three. Adding sixty-three to four, we get 67 plus 12 root 7. Seven's prime, and so it can't be um, factored any further. 
So you get 67 plus 12 root 7. And that's as simplified as that binomial squared can be.